Good morning and welcome. Data management and protection is essential for any organization. To ensure the accuracy, security, and usage of your data throughout its life cycle. As somebody has rightly said, data is the new oil. And in today's era of artificial intelligence, it's even more relevant. Backup Exec has been protecting your workloads for ages now. With the release of BE25, there are some new features and support that I would like to highlight. If you've already adopted Windows Server 2025 or on the verge of adoption, because of some unique security features which has added, such as mandatory LDAP encryption, support for TLS 1.3, or increased limit for VM memory and compute, you can use it confidently and rest assured that it will be protected by Backup Exec 25. Now, Backup Exec has been protecting your SaaS workloads such as Exchange Online, SharePoint Online, and OneDrive. With the new version release, you can also help and protect your team's private channel. You can also restore your Exchange Online items to a PST file. And this can be also viewed in your Microsoft Outlook. Role-based access control is a great way of giving access based on their job description. With the release of 25 version, it has added one more role as part of the role-based access control called Restore Administrator, along with some of the other roles which were already there before, such as Administrator, Storage Admin, Backup and Restore, or if you just want to give the view access only to your Backup and Restore application. With the BE25, they've also added malware detection version 2 by utilizing Semantic Engine. Along with some of the other support that they've added is the support for NetApp, ONTAP cluster, as well as some of the other cloud regions which were not there before. I would recommend to check on the Backup Exec site to see all the features and support which you can utilize and start the trial version. Hopefully this was helpful. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.